by my side, thick and thin, highs and lows, don't let go. We gon' ride, we gon' Hey everyone, for today's video I'm going to be doing a video called To My Future Me. And basically I was inspired by two videos and it was, um, I think it was To My Future Wife and Dear Future Me. I'm gonna put the videos, I'm gonna put the links of the videos down below. But basically both videos, they're talking to their future self. So to start off, I'm going to be saying hi to my future self. Hi, future me. And... I have a lot of questions for you, like, what's it called, how's it going, what's going on in your life, what college did you end up going to, I recently got, I wanted to go to CSULA and I got rejected, I was pretty bummed about it, I was really sad because I was looking forward to moving to LA, but I didn't, and then I still have response from other two colleges that I'm waiting for. Where did I end up going, did I actually end up going to school I didn't want to go to, or end up going to school? going to my second choice school Ugh, I just so many questions like the YouTube thing like did I just do it for fun because I love making YouTube videos I don't have to have many views I just love making them and I have a great time making them but did I actually make it big in YouTube or did I act it or I'm just gonna look back and look at my videos and be like oh my god I had so much fun making them hopefully my future children will never see these videos they will, they're gonna be thinking I'm crazy making YouTube videos. Who knows what's going on? Okay, right now I'm going through a really tough time. It's just for school. I'm about to graduate in three months. And I'm, I'm a senior in high school. I'm like, come on, there's a stressful year. A lot of stuff is going on. I'm finally gonna graduate high school. I remember when I was a freshman. Pretty sure she to me. I remember when you were a freshman. Ooh, those freshman year but pictures. You have to burn those future me. You have to burn those. Burn middle school to ninth grade. Tenth grade was decent. Junior year, eh, getting better, no how to use makeup. Senior year, I just say I became a bum again at school. I don't even try. But the point is, what's it called? You're finally gonna graduate high school and it's going to be amazing. I don't know where life is going to take you. Where am I going to be in 10 years? Am I going to be making music? Okay. I want for my future job, I would love to be making music. Or at least somewhere in the music industry. I don't care if I'm a songwriter or I'm producing music or I don't know. I'm a singing teacher, a piano teacher, whatever. But as long as I'm making music, I want to be making music for the rest of my life. I love it. I play the piano. I sing. I love to write songs poems everything i wonder if i ever make it big or not but all i just want to tell you is no matter what people tell you or no matter what people tell you that your dream is ridiculous i will never make it or you'll never achieve it remember you've gone through years and years of believing in your dream and keep going keep pulling through even if the future me is still not there yet pull through be happy what you love to do I wonder if I change careers. Why if somehow I stop loving music? I don't think it's possible. But still, why if I do? Why if my career changes? I also love makeup and hair and all that stuff. I wonder if I make it in that. Um, and my hairstylist and my makeup artist, because I love makeup. I love you know makeup on people, myself, everything. I wonder. I wonder where life is gonna take me. Like I said, I'm going through lots of time with school, stress, and just everything, and personal stuff. And I've always pulled through. Future me, you always pulled through. You know that you've gone through a lot of stuff in your life. And you always try to keep on smiling and try to be positive and happy. I wonder if I turn better in the future. Hopefully, I don't. Hopefully, I stay positive and happy as I am now. And always smiling. I think a smile is the best thing that a girl can wear. And I love helping people. I wonder if I end up helping like a career of helping people or just helping people in general. I wonder if I travel, if I go anywhere. I wonder if I go to New York, go to LA, go to Florida, Chicago, all the places that I really want to visit. I'm a city girl. I love the city. Don't get me wrong. I love the woods and camping survival. I can survive. Because my goal in life is to live two places at once. To live in LA and New York. Both at the same time. 
I know it's kind of weird, like how you live both at the same time, but I want to live in two places. I want to spend two weeks in New York and two weeks in LA. I don't know. People will be like, oh my god, that's stressful, the time zone, everything, but that's what I want to do. I want to have, I want to live in two places at the same time. Two wonderful cities. What? Cities that never sleep? Like, I'm doing what I love. I'm with people that I love. I wonder how my family. I wonder how my brain is taller. Oh, the guy is he's small. You're now he's gonna think when he's older. Wonder if his voice ever needs deeper. He has a chipmunk voice. And I remember, be nice to little brother, even though he's been wrong sometimes. Be nice to him, man. Always be happy because he's always been there for you. And your family has too. And your friends appreciate your friends. Appreciate the people that come into your life and people leave too there are people who are gonna leave from your life they're just gonna be there for a while and appreciate them love them and i need to stop saying it just, just be happy stay happy hopefully buffy vampire slayer is still one of your favorite shows the walking dead american horror stories all those horror shows that people don't like also mystery shows i love mystery shows when if i get to meet some of the people that I, I love, hopefully I ever get to meet. Hopefully I get to meet Selena Gomez, Hurley Duff, the, um, Bethany Moda. She's also one of my idols. I wonder if I get to meet any YouTube star. I wonder if I ever get to meet oh, my husband, Bonnie Banks. I wonder if I ever get to meet him. Because we all know he's going to be my future husband. Bonnie, if you ever see this... Yes, I have the hugest crush on you. I wonder if I still have a crush on you in the future. Because, oh, you are a babe. I just want you to know, future me, again, like I said, be happy. Just, oh, just try to be as happy as you can. Right now, it's hard. It's been hard, but you always pull through. You're always happy. And you love music and your passion. And just keep doing what you do. You're doing a great job so far. So far, I've turned out great. So you do me, keep doing what you're doing, and that's it. Hopefully, I watch you in the future, and I smile. I smile. I'm just like I finally, I finally, I, I see what's going on in my life, but I pulled through, and I'm happy. I'm content. Hopefully, future me, you're happy, and beautiful, as you always been. Don't forget always go to church and god always comes first and your family comes second and brush your teeth floss you know the usual i wonder if i still have my parents if i moved out hopefully i move out by this year but so bye future me hopefully i get to see you in the future stay, stay as cool as ever of course duh and funny and weird we all know um, down low, I'm a dork, so I am a true dork and a nerd. Yes, I'm smart in the down low. I have nerd glasses, so say nerdy, dorky, weird girl that you are. I say beautiful and always smile. Bye. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Y'all gonna get me bowed up when that beat hit us like three kicks in your.